Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss about how to find out which city has most number of employees. So see right here in all uh, these two tables. So right here I am using these two tables. So this is the record inside these two tables. So see right here TPT number and DPT number is the column columns between these two tables. So these two tables has the column common column. Now here after I am going to find out which location has the highest number of employees by uh, doing joining concept. So let's write the query. So I am going to use select a statement and you have to going to give low here after count aggregator function. So going to count add here total number of dpt number in emp table. So add here let's write as got dot emp dot dpt number. Now here after let's give alias d underscore num. Now from here use from escort dot emp table going to use. Now here after let's use inner join. So inner join only return matching values. So inner join with on clause add here using so escort dot emp table dot dpt number. So going to compare with dpt number. So add here 10, 10 that match. So add here it's 3 times it's match. So it will return 3, here 20 match. Add here. Or oh, it's match uh, of 5 times. So it will return 5. Add here. In 30 it's return five, uh, 6 times. So it will return 6 times. So add here 40 is not matching with anyone. So not going to return this one. Add here. So only matching values or city going to return. So escort.emp.dpt number and here after let's use escort dot or dpt dot dpt number. Now here after let's make group by. So going to make group by on LOC column. Now here after let's give order group by LOC here after order by so order by D name. Sorry, uh, order by add here account a star. So this will count add here total number of TP number here after. Let's make that in descending order. So and I am getting the error message select. Okay, let's execute first. So, and I am getting the error message or uh, select loc or uh, count escort dot as dm from escort dot emp inner join. So, inner join. So, and I am going to do the inner join at here with escort dot dpt table. Now, all the error out. So, let's execute that. So see right here, it, I'm getting this output. So right here, Chicago has the uh, uh, six. It's returning. So uh, it means that means uh, Chicago has uh, six employees. Dallas has five employees. New York has uh, three employees. Now here, let's uh, check. So see right here, ten. So ten, it's uh, three times. So that right here, ten. So it's uh, it will return three. So right here, New York has uh, three employees. Now here after 20, 20, 20. So it's a 5 times. So it will match. So 20 match with here. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one. So here uh, it will return. Dallas has the 5 employees. Now here after 30 match with 30. So add here 30 match with 30. So it will match 6 times. So add so that it will return add here. Or uh, Chicago has 6 employees. But at here there is no any 40. So there are no any matching values. So this will not return. So 40 Boston has no any employees. So see at here in 40 there is no any 40 inside. So Boston has no any employees. So it will not return. So that when I execute this query. So it's returning 6, 5, 3. Now I will display at here. Uh, which country has most number of employees. So let's copy that one. And you have to paste it down. So, and you are going to use add here or top one. 
top one. So this will return at here or this top one values. So top one and here give L or C. Now if you execute so top location that will return. So top return the so location is the Chicago has six employees. So this is the way we can find out which country city has the highest number of employees by using all these two tables and by using at a inner chain concept. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. And one more thing I already discussed about inner chain, outer chain and left outer chain, full outer chain in my previous video. So please scroll through that one. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next video. Thank you.